Hello guys, it's been a long time between updates. That's because the first machine shop I took it to uh, basically sat on it for two months and didn't do a thing. I then took it to the machine shop that did all the work and did it very well, thank you very much. And uh, I only got it back from them about two weeks ago. So I've assembled a motor and I will go into some detail about that at a different time probably. But I just wanted to show you the engine on the stand. I didn't take any videos of me assembling it due to the amount of time I had lost so this will be just an incremental update I guess. The engine as you see it is a 4 litre 30 thou over stock crank forged rods forged pistons LS valves uh, 515 510 lift cam in around the 218 220 duration somewhere there. Uh, turbo is a GT3582 PSR ball bearing unit. It's got a 1.01 .01 exhaust housing on it, so somewhat bigger than my previous one. The intercooler is an Aeroflow air to water unit. It is a Chinese one, but it's a branded Chinese one. Um, it's a lot bigger than the one I had previously. It won't clear the bonnet stock, but I will come up with something on that. Uh, everything's brand new pretty much, I think other than the power steering pump and the aircon pump. I haven't wrapped the exhaust yet, but the exhaust is basically long tube headers, three into two, into one, into a V-band. We have that crossover pipe, which comes up in the factory location. I then have that crossover pipe going into the bottom of the turbo. As you can see, the clearances here are all very, very tight. There's a lot of heat management required to run this sort of setup. It's very similar to my original setup. You have GFB 44 mil external wastegate. That branches off out of there. It is plumbed back into the dump pipe, as you can see through there. There is a slip joint in here too not a lot more to tell you on the outside really um, all the good stuff is inside but tomorrow the car goes sorry the motor goes back in the car with any luck it'll all fire up it'll all run and nothing will explode during the run-in or the dyno process and I'll probably come back to you at that point with some more information about it but I just thought I'd give you all a quick look and show you that it is alive and it is coming together thanks very much for watching